That's the famous glue gun. We're in agreement on this one. Get through this place fast as possible. You're looking for a maintenance airlock to a utility tunnel called the Guts. It'll take you all the way to the top of the station. Somebody's having a good time. Psychoscope required beyond this point. Psychoscope. Guess we gotta go find a psychoscope. required beyond this point. What is the psychoscope? Oh. Is 
said, I need to switch batteries in this thing because this battery's dying. Hold on, be right back. Okay, I'm back. I switched batteries in this thing. We're gonna find a way to get through this damn door. I don't know where the hell I'm supposed to be going, but it looks like I gotta be a little bit of an explorer to find the thing I'm looking for. I feel really stupid, you are but not. what is why is the psychoscope something that I cannot seem to find? Oh, you know where it is? Actually, there's over there. It's like a hole. What is that? Oh, wow. Like a hole through the floor, you have to jump down to my body. Get where is it? Oh, it's in the alley. Uh, I'm like, I've been walking around for 20 minutes going like, I don't know what the hell I'm looking for. <laughs> so back at the other area? Yes, you know the, uh, the bathroom is Yes. Go back to the back. Oh, okay. Oh, shoot. Huh? Oh, wait, and then go to the other side. Okay. Okay, now we're, now we're maybe going to make some progress here. Okay. And then... <laughs> Literally on the one body I didn't check. Perfect. It's just like a regular day on the random cast. Just walking around. Thank you so much. <sighs> check everybody. Everybody, check everybody. <sighs> you guys are gonna love that one on the video. <laughs> it's a half hour of trying to find that damn thing. <laughs> I could be climbing up walls. The scope was a breakthrough. Apart from neuromods, it's the most important tech on Talos 1. There we go. Alright, now we're making progress. Kind of. Use it to scan the type of organisms if you want to learn what makes them tick. You invented it, by the way. Let's, now let's 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 play some of the game. Oh hi. I could use some health now, though. That would be good. Oh, shoot. Detour. Hope it's a good detour. All right, Morgan. I know I can't make you stay put, but you're gonna die down there if you don't listen to me. You need to calibrate your psychoscope. Try scanning the Typhon specimens around you. Once you get enough scan data, the labs will open. More importantly, you'll be able to install Typhon based neuromods. Typhon based neuromods, you'll be unstoppable. I like that. Being unstoppable is a nice idea. This is all about Morgan. You spent three years of your life making it possible. Putting what they can do into us, you've just forgotten. Please calibrate your scope before entering examination. 
Oh, there we go. Kinetic Blast. Nice. Ooh. Alright. So we got create a physical blast that deals up to 50 damage and pushes away everything within 5 meters of the target area. Nice. I like it. That works. somewhere.
I don't know that those were useful at all, but we'll see. consequences I can't yet see. I don't want you to lose yourself. Never lose yourself. Especially not in the space station with creepy crawling critters made out of goo running around. It's bad, bad. Hello, Dr. Yu. Dr. Yu. Kind of fucked up. Oh, look, this is the goo hallway from the uh, from the trailer. I think. Does it say which way? I'm not entirely sure. This is Lab A. I like to explore everything, you know, just to be safe. Because apparently that worked out real well for me earlier in the game when I missed the damn body that had the psychoscropotropo, whatever the hell on it. This thing find me, please. There we go. <laughs> it's the low light. The low light screws up the camera. <laughs> Oh my god. 
So this place doesn't look safe. 
Restore side points for Sokoka. probably didn't see what just happened, but I got wrecked by like four of them, and I'm just forgetting to use the health kits because I'm like, I don't wanna. <gasps> but the checkpointing system looks like it's, well, it may be for the demo, but it looks like it's pretty, pretty good so far. Seems like it's making sense. Game's a little terrifying. Make sure I use effective aiming techniques so that I don't run out of ammo. Very important. Basics of video gaming. Aim for the head. Unless it's dead space, then you aim for the limbs. But this is not dead space. I can see the, uh... I can definitely see the system shock. Uh, the, the people comparing this to system shock. Where that's coming from is definitely has that kind of you're on a crazy spaceship kind of thing going. Very tense. Extremely tense. Emails. Um, I'm gonna skip story stuff that's in the environment just for the sake of this, so that I can actually see more of the game. Oh wow. I'm a little... My, my, 
my, my heart's pounding a little bit. This is this is intense stuff. Hello, Doctor Yu. You're not going to have a lot of ammo at your disposal all the time. So you're going to have to be smart about what you shoot and when. Otherwise, you're going to blow through all your ammo and have nothing left. Also, I should probably use a health kit. GDUs. Wasn't there a, there was a door that had like fire in it that I wanted to go through? Oh, maybe it was in the next room. I think it was in the next room. Again, it's so funny. It's like the alien isolation slash sh system shock vibe. That's really kind of awesome. Really liking it. Yeah, this room. Okay. Let's see if we can get through here. Ah, dang it. Wow, okay, that sucked. You bastard. <laughs> smart enough to know how to kill me, but not smart enough to know not to go through fire. That's a bad bad. You shouldn't do that. And now I need to use another health kit, which I'm not excited about at all. Guns, ammo, 
I saw one of them science types go. <laughs> he just freezes there. Okay. That's good. Uh, you get me out of here. I'll let you have it. Yeah, I trust him. Aaron. Aaron Ingram. Don't know you from Adam. You think I'm gonna trust you right away? <laughs> yeah. Let's see how that works for you. That didn't work. <laughs> Most other fellas were Russian. I speak a little, but as you can tell, I ain't from there. <laughs> as you might have guessed. You're still speaking English, buddy. That's not Russian. <sighs> what the hell? Am I not seeing something that's in there? Oh, it's throwing the boxes around. I don't know. Weird. Um, so I guess we gotta get this guy out of here somehow. Lockdown in effect. Come on now, God damn it, let me out. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. Up in here anymore. I want to press everything with the mouse button, and it's not the way to do it. I do it with the F key, which is weird. I would not probably switch those. Now that's what I'm talking about. Some human decency, friend. Now you're the one person who showed me any real kindness, and you can believe I won't forget it. Well, if you still want that code, it's 8714. 8714. Okay, now I don't need you anymore. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not where did he go? F button, Rob. F. Nice. Ooh, shotgun. Yeah, baby, shotgun. Shotgun shells. Oh. Upgrade. Firepower recoil ammo. Excellent. <sighs> All right. Anything else that I... Ooh. Detonator. No, it's not. EMP charge. I like it. Why would you take the gun? Maybe you can use, use it for parts later? I don't know. There's something I'm missing about, like, because you can still take more guns, even if you already have that gun, so I'm assuming you can break it down for parts to make more stuff. I don't know. I'm not entirely clear on that. I like my glue gun. I did search him. Okay. You just you're just gonna hang out here now? Listen, you running any other fellas wearing a green jumpsuit? Watch your ass. 
But they ain't all decent human beings like me. Good advice. It's very good advice. <laughs> Something in here now? That sound, man, that sound is terrifying. Dr. Gear. security protocol. You'll have to finish what they started. Back in the 60s and 70s, the first research teams tried to communicate with the Typhon, but this proved impossible. Their cerebral structures are highly developed and intentional, but somehow unapproachable. They have no speech of their own, no language. They don't even seem to see us. Not like we see ourselves, I mean. I'm generalizing when I say us, of course. I'm not a person. Not like you. I'm not a person, not like you. More questions than answers, I gotta say, man.
because there's nothing else in here. Since you're not an alien, 